Hello everyone. Welcome to Melda 242 and Merry Christmas YouTube family. And I'm in Fort Lauderdale. Today we would be fixing Bahamian baked macaroni and cheese. But before we begin, I'd like to say thank you to all of my subscribers thus far. And I'd like to also send out a very special shout out to my newest sister by way of YouTube, Simply Deborah. Okay, so today I will be preparing Bahamian baked macaroni and cheese. If you want to see how this is prepared, then keep on watching. Let's begin. Okay, I'm going to put the noodles in a pot of boiling water and a half a stick of butter. Now they're going to have to cook until they're really soft. I'm giving it a, ch a quick check. You can cook a little bit more. I'm just checking it out. Look at the texture of the noodles. You see the shape of it? Okay, all of the water, most of the water is dissolved from the noodles. I'm adding the butter, red pepper, onion, celery, yellow peppers, the green peppers. So that's three types of pepper. Red, green, yellow. I'm going to give this a, um, a mix until the butter has melted. Okay, now I have the stove turned down to low, on low heat. I'm just going to mix up all of this hair together. Look at the texture of the, the noodles, the macaroni. Now I have some um, garlic salt. It's a little mixture my, my sister taught me. Garlic salt, onion powder, and, some, and a couple other seasoning mixed together. So that's like a secret ingredient. Secret ingredient. Garlic salt, onion powder, and a couple others together mix all of that together and every time you're cooking you're gonna put a little bit in the pan in the pot now to this I'm going to add a half a tin of carnation evaporated milk those eggs you see in the background that that's for our potato salad Checking the stove, okay. I'm checking my seasoning, my seasoning right now to see if I have enough garlic salt in it. I didn't use the regular salt. I'm just using my garlic salt mixture. Now I'm adding the three packets of cream sauce, Velveeta cream sauce. That's going to give it a nice cheesy flavor as well as the color. Now I'm going to mix that together. A 
this is the last pack that's pack it and after which I'm going to add the the eggs I'm gonna add about four eggs four large eggs okay I'm greasing my foil pan with some spray buttered spray just spraying it real good now I'm pouring the mixture into the pan get all of that out all right we just she's just making sure that it's evenly distributed throughout the pan level I'm adding this the sharp cheddar on, on the top of the the macaroni mixture and some paprika gonna sprinkle a bit of that at the top I just like to put it at the top not in the mixture itself <laughs> it's a good exercise shake 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 And that's the finished product after about 15 20 minutes and this looks really good Bahamian baked macaroni and cheese Ooh, try some today you will love it <laughs>